Open up the world! <sighs> it's your friendly neighbor, it's Gator here. Hanging out today, doing stuff and things. Don't shoot! I don't know why you would shoot. Playing Ark Survival Evolved on the Pooping Evolved server. Making up some metal ramps, peeps. Hope you guys are having a good day. I'm having a really good day. We're back doing stuff and things. You know, the last couple of episodes we did some... What did we do? We did some taming of the new Mosasaur. We got that stuff and things taken care of so you guys could see that. You guys smashed the like button for me. You killed it. We did baby dinosaur breeding. You guys killed it on that video. Um, and then we did the, the bringing the T-Rex to maturation and we made Y-Tooth. Oh man, there's been, an, there's been some sort of a, an, an attack on the base. It looks like the guys aren't actually, um, they're not lined up anymore. Look at them all. They're in a little family triangle. But we made, is this Y-Tooth? No. Are you y Who's Y-Tooth? There he is. And we made Y-Tooth, and he's the thing. So, yeah, and you guys killed it on all the thumbs up, showing your support. Thank you guys so much for doing that for me. If you guys like this video, please don't forget to hit the like button. And if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe. But today, we're back to getting some base building done. We still can't build a ramp here. Very unfortunate. Very, very unfortunate. Want to put a ramp here. Can't put a ramp here. Try doing some stuff and things. Try taking some, some ramps down and trying a bunch of different stuff to get it to happen. I don't think it's going to. Now, somebody in the comments section or on Twitter or somewhere pointed out to me that there is a mod, a collisions mod, that would allow us to possibly place something there. And uh, so if you guys don't know, Drax does um, our, a lot of our administration work. Well, he does basically almost all of our administration work. I do a very, very tiny, tiny amount of administration work as far as like being able to update the server and stuff and things like that. But Drax has been taking a look at this collisions mod. It might be something that we add in because this stuff is very, very frustrating. You know, uh, we want to build some really epic, cool stuff. And um, if you're like me, it's not an OCD thing as much as it is just a completion thing. Like, it kind of bugs me that that's not there. You know, I wish that I could put a ramp there. So if we do that, I'll, I'll be sure to let you guys know exactly what's going on. But today, what I wanted to get into is I've been gathering up some metal. I've been in the off time doing a lot of off-camera work. I haven't got a ton of metal left because we did build a huge amount more of stuff and things in here. So we've got 117 metal pillars now, 109 metal ceilings. I built 34 metal ramps and still have a bunch of metal there. Now, as well as all the metal gathering that I've been doing, I've also been getting cementing, cementing paste going. Um, actually, I was reading that through, down through the comments again. I know a few people have been saying that going out on your frog is really the way to go for cementing paste. Now, and I've said this in a couple of videos, because we don't have, or we have the Titan Monirna and the Mega Nora turned down on the server, it really makes it hard to find those guys. Um, and we have their spawn rates turned out a little bit. And so it, it hasn't been super duper effective. So let's take a look here. Do we have any more cementing paste in there? No, but inside of here, we have a full large storage box of cementing paste and then over here we've got i think oh wait i thought we had more somewhere you know what i brought it over to build with that's right so a full box here and then i went ahead and got a bunch more of chitin we're all full up on that as well um but we're running low on some other stuff wood we're a little low on thatch we're a little low on because i also built 105 wooden pillars and 201 thatch roofs it's not ceilings remember roofs if you're looking for it so yeah, basically what I wanted to do is make sure that today we wanted to get back to doing some building. And I like to have a lot of this off-camera stuff done so we can just have a good... Double click! So we just have a good time doing some building stuff and things. And what I want to start with today is getting this thing turned over, changed over into metal. Um, and the reason that I want to do that is because I want to start placing our vaults. So taking all of these things into account, let us look at the vaults. Vaults? Vaults. Wait. Where's the vault, Ingram? I'm assuming it's in the fabricator. Let us take the double and head over to slow mobility so we can take a look at the vault recipe. I think it's 800 metal. I <laughs> can't even believe it's so expensive. So let's take a look here. There we go. Structures, metal, storage, bam. Oh, it's not that bad. Not that bad. Yeah, you know, it really isn't actually. 60 polymer of which we've made a bunch more. You can see I've got, what is that? 270, 85? Um, and so we've got on the polymer, we have the metal ingots, we've got cementing paste, and we have the oil. Um, I want to make six of these bad boys to start with and see how we're, they're going to work. Uh, so let's go ahead and start getting that done, man. All right, so what we're going to do, we're going to come over here. We're going to go ahead and get on. Uh, nope, not you. No, why? Um, where did Tonnage go? Where are you, Tonnage? 
Where is Tonnage? This is a very good question. I know he's not over here by Toad and Hardware. I know he's not over here. Where are you, Tonnage? There he is. All right, so we're going to grab Tonnage. I'm going to go ahead and um, I'm going to get all the stuff and things we need inside the Fabricator to build the sixth vault, and then we're going to do it, papes. BRBs. And we're back. And I've crafted up a bunch more polymer. It's going to be loud over here in, in the construction zone. I had to grab some more of the cementing paste, uh, structures, metal, storage. Six. Let's do it, peeps. How much XP do we get from this? Oh, baby. 822. 823, basically, effectively. Holy moly. That was like 200. And four. 205. Is that right? It will be 437. Yeah, 205 XP per. And we're almost at level 85 now, which is baller. All right, so now after we get these, how much do they weigh? Oh my gosh, they're super heavy. Holy crap, oh, it's going to be 120 pounds. This. 120, it doesn't say pounds. 120 weight units. All right, so we're going to squirt these onto tonnage. We will bring him over. Uh, let me out. We'll bring him over this really direction. Now, before we place these, we've got to start converting this building over. We've got to start making it into a metal building. So, this is where things get a little bit scary. Um, just because we want to really make sure we're taking the time to place stuff and things the correct way. You know, um, we want to do a really good job of this because these things are very, very expensive. So, we're... Are you following me? Are you following me? We're going to uh, start our day off today by replacing some of the ce some of these roofs, I guess. Oh, you know what? No, that's not correct. We're going to do these first. Can I carry 67? I can. Let's go down to like 50. Am I still burdened? Oh, baby. I can't hold 50 of these bad boys. So if we come into here like so and then like here like so and then we come over into here like so, we should be able to start replacing stuff and things. So if we go like this... Oh, baby! Oh, wait. There's a wooden one inside of there. What? See, this is the crap. That is a pain in the butt. All right, we broke that one. But there is a wood pillar inside of here. Oh, we can demolish it. Oh, will this be a big problem? No, we nailed it. I still can't be stopped. It didn't even... was not a big problem. Okay, we may have had a problem. Oh, wait. There we go. We got this. We're getting it. We got this. So if we go... Now the day can't be stopped, and now it's a big wooden pillar. Now in a second, there's pieces of wood in there, but they should, like, evaporate. Um, but when you over... See, that stinks. See how the design, when it overstacks, it kind of makes the little internal, like, these little, whatever these are, these little panels kind of look wacky? Eh, what can you do? We can't, we can't do everything perfectly all the time. It's just not possible, I guess. So, like so, and then is there another one? Right here? See that wood pillar stayed inside of there. That's super weird. Can we still get the... Oh, no, metal pillar. We don't want to do that. Wood pillar. Okay. All right, it's working out. Now that it's the be stopped. Oh, I think, see, the top there, there's another wooden pillar that didn't demolish on both tops. Well, it is the best way to get this done. So, all right, I'm going to go ahead and begin the process of replacing all the stuff and things. Do you think we need to break that other metal? Do you think we need to like this little bit of metal down there? A little bit of wood, I mean? Do we need to really do this? I guess we do. Oh, now it's perfect. It's way better. All right, guys. So I'm going to do this structure. And uh, I'm going to try to save all the stuff and things I can. You know, actually, what I'll do as well is I will bring William Shatner over and dump stuff on him. But yeah, let's replace all the pillars. Let's do it, peace. <laughs> Now that can't be, can't be stopped. Over there, boom, bam, can't 
stop of the day. Check it out, peeps. One of the most amazing things has happened. We are able to place all the ramps down here. So it lines up with the ground. It's so cool. It looks so amazing and complete. And I love it. And I'm so excited about it. I hope you guys like the little montage there. I thought it was time. We owed you one, I think. And so I figured we'd do one. If you guys like that stuff, make sure you hit the thumbs up and show your support. So can I just break these like so? Yeah, that'll smash. That'll smash out, right? All right, let's see. I'm just going to make these even with these foundations. And I actually just want to put these in because I think it'll look kind of cool. So let's go ahead and add these guys in here, too. I wanted to bring you guys back before everything was complete so you could see some of the process. So that looks this will look cool once all that's done. But then we got all these thatch foundations or thatch ceilings, pardon me, to get rid of. So we're going to demolish these. Then I thought we'd talk about a couple of things as well. And the things that we want to talk about. Well, the first thing is I think I mentioned... Um, something before about suggestions coming in on Twitter. So I do read a lot of stuff and things on Twitter. If you guys don't know, my Twitter is at SL1PG8R. And there's a link in the down there if you want to follow me there. Um, but there was... Oh, crapo. There was another suggestion that came from Twitter. I'm trying to remember what it is on the top of my... On the on the top of my brain. On the tip of my tongue. Um, I think that the other thing that somebody was saying on Twitter that I wanted to mention... Oh, yeah, this is what it was. Is that when we come up here, when we add the ceilings... This um, top of this does stick out a little bit, and it will stick out a little bit less. Like, we can actually probably... Can we add? We could do... We could just do two right now so you can see it. So it won't be that bad. It'll just be a little bit of a thing. It still blocks our way from walking, but whatever. The pro platform down there is big enough. But that's one of the things that I wanted to mention. Um, but then down on here... Also, we did our 500,000 subscriber vlog the other day and uh, really got some great feedback. I'm really glad you guys like that. If you didn't check it out, um, I will just go ahead and let you know that I uh, dressed up in a dinosaur costume. Well, actually, no. Let me put it to you this way. If you forget that, I'll just edit that out. Brian made an appearance. Let's just put it that way. Brian was in the vlog, okay? So make sure you go and check it out there. And um, in that vlog, I also had talked about that we are doing a banner competition. So that's something that I wanted to tell you guys about here, too. Because I know not everybody checked. Oh, baby, we just got the whole thing. All right, sweet. So I know not everybody checks out the vlogs. So I wanted to tell you guys that over at slipgator.com slash art comp. So it's A-R-T-C-O-M-P. You can submit pics. We got to figure out how we're going to get these touch ceilings down. That's not going to be easy. But you can submit pictures. And what I want to do is we're doing a banner contest. So a contest... For a um, new banner for the YouTube channel, and then second place will be on the Twitter, and then third place will be on the Facebook. So you can submit your stuff and things there. Now, I'm just going to tell you here really quickly, there's a couple of things to take into account with the banner competition. One is, we really want to prefer to get a PNG file, something that has layers. Not a JPEG, something that has layers. Number two, you're going to want to use like a YouTube banner template. If you just type in, Google it, YouTube Tanner banner template, Tanner banner template, banner template, you'll get a template for it. And you want to try to use as much of it as you can. Obviously, you want the center portion of the template to be have the most like yeah, visual information in it and stuff and things like that. But um, you want to kind of use the whole thing. And then also, we're going for a non-specific gaming type of feel. So not one game, not an Arc banner, not a, not a Minecraft banner, just an everything banner. A Slipgator banner is really what we're looking for. So, um, yeah, so you can submit them over there. And uh, first, second, and third place prize, we're going to win an Ar um, a key to Arc and then some other stuff and things, too. I think we're going to do a couple something something. Probably t-shirt or something like that. I'm not really sure. But um, yeah, so check it out. Go ahead and if you want to do that, go ahead over there and submit your, your stuff and things to slipgator.com slash art comp. And I'll try to remember to put some links in the down there for, the, for, the, for that so you'll know where to go. But I'm trying to think of how we're going to get these ceilings down. And I have an idea. And we're back. I think I've got the idea correct. We found a way to get these guys down. This is going to take a minute for sure. Um, I tried bringing hardware over, but he's too tall. Um, he actually is just too big. And then I'm wondering if we just destroy, like, in the... Oh, crap. No, you've got to stop having your broken leg weirdness. 
if we just destroy the ones that are attached to the pillars, um, if we can get everything to fall. I'm not exactly sure. Because you saw when we were doing them underneath, eventually, after we got a couple of them done, like, everything fell, which would be ideal. So let's see here. We get this guy here. Um, I don't really care that much about all these materials. Like, thatch and wood and stuff, we can get a lot of that pretty quickly. I mean, I like to save as much of it as we can, but it ain't, it ain't that big of a deal. Come on, give it to me. All right, let's see. We got to move a little bit closer like this. Uh, let's get on your head. Let me climb on your head, Wol William Shatner. I almost said Will Smith. Thatch ceiling. Got it. Nailed it, baby. Yes! Did it work? Oh, yeah, baby. That worked. Oh, so cool. All right. So now let's take a step back here, ladies and gentle peeps. Let's take a little step back and see what we've done. See what our metal stuff and things looks like. Oh, come on, Thatch. Despawn, Thatch Garbo. Oh, baby, that looks so much better. Oh, I like the look of it a lot. That is cool, man. I hope that you guys like... Oh, there's a pillar right there. Oh, crap. I don't know how I'm going to get those out of there. You'll never notice. Just don't... Just disregard that. Um, maybe I'll build something up. Or possibly could try to get a wallsmith and then pull it down. You can see it right inside of there. The little pieces of wood right there. Everything else, I do believe... Oh, no, there's another one. So we'll have to get wallsmith over. But I like this, the way that this looks much better than the way that the um, the thatch and the wood looks, which is cool too, but this is way more modern. All right, so the reason that we're doing this, if you remember, from way back a couple of minutes ago, is that we are going to try to... Where are they? They're on poundage, right? We put... Oh, you got in the level, baby. Good job, man. All right, no, they're not on poundage. They're on tonnage then. Who is... There's William Shatner. Where the crap is he? Gosh, I gotta, you know, the next thing we're gonna do probably is build something to organize our dinos here because it is getting to the point where it's so hard for me to see everybody. All right, here he is over here. So over here on tonnage is what we're looking for. I do believe this is where we put him. Do you have him on you? There he is. Nail the dice. He can't be stopped. We'll go squirt those and squirt those on him like that. And then we'll pull him over with our six vaults. So gotta kind of get an idea of how we're gonna place these gonna be a little bit tricky because they're humongous i don't know if you guys have ever played around with vaults before but they're massive um so let's take a look here and see exactly how big these are gonna be so if we go into k mode we're gonna have to back up to like here oh my gosh that's actually gonna make it kind of cramped in here you'll still be able to get a mammoth then i do believe um let's go ahead and let's go like this all right better let's go turn a little bit Okay, not not terrible. Let's take a look at that angle right there. See, I'm going to use the edge of the bottom of the building there to, to, to line this up. And you can see it's a little bit turned. So if I just go ever so slightly. <gasps> Did we get it? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Now let's line it up with this line right here. You can see right there on the edge. That's where we're going to line it up with. And we'll leave it about a rivet's length back from the edge of the wall like so. Like this and like that. Nailed it, Ace that can't be stopped. We've placed our first vault, ladies and gentle peeps. It is unbelievable. All right, now, can we recreate this process? So let's go uh, vault. Okay. All right, let's move it out a little bit. There we go. Now we can squirt back around here. Get over like so. Needs to change a little bit, so we're going to turn ever so slightly. We're going to get it right up to the edge there so we can see if it's even. It looks... Pretty darn even. Look at that. Pretty darn good. And it's about exactly the same place as the other one is. Nailed it, Ace. It can't be stopped. Two vaults. We're killing it, peeps. This has turned out really good. So I'm wondering. We should be able to fit. Oh, no, 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 no. Are we? We're not going to. Oh, maybe. Maybe. Oh. I'm wondering if we're going to be able to get three in. We probably shouldn't have saved this space right here. Um, Yeah, I guess I'm just going to start placing them. I'm going to do a little bit more off camera. And just get these placed up and make sure. My concern is that the, the last one is going to overlap um, with the with the um, the elevator. So I'm going to place two and make sure it works. And then I'll be our bees, peeps. And we're back. And it's looking great, peeps. I love how this is turning out so far. So check it out. We get our mammoth up inside of here. We hop off. And then from right here, you can access the inventory. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. You can access the inventory of the mammoth, for instance. Spin right around. So you can overburden yourself really good. Spin right around and then access the inside of the vault. And I actually did decide to move these back a little bit. Um, I had the two placed. I destroyed them and then 
So I had all the pieces to build one, and then I just built one more. And I moved them back a little bit. Because I just thought that you can see, like, the, I figured they were going to overlap. So instead of taking that risk with them overlapping, we would just do this. So um, now, turn the elevator on. Just to double check. Of course it's going to clear. We're just going to make sure it clears the ceilings, too. Um, I haven't actually tested this yet, so here's hoping everything works out okay. All right, looks good. We're good to go there. We can just go back down again now. But this is definitely looking a lot better than um, than what we had before, and I really like how it's turning out. Um, I'm not sure about... I don't know. I'm thinking about possibly adding something in here to change the look a little bit, but I'm not really sure right yet. Not exactly sure. But I like that we have a metal, and I like it's, that it's good to go. And I think it's amazing that we got this done in kind of like one clip. Um, let's take a look at kind of what how many supplies we've got left over here. So I don't have anything metal on you. I think tonnage had a bunch. Let's just check poundage really quick just to see. Yeah, I don't have anything on you. So um, if we take tonnage, we've got some stuff left. Let's fly back over to storage and just kind of see what our backup supply is now of stuff and things over here. Let's go, go ahead and take a look. How much did we use? Ugh. All right, so we've got no. Oh, crap. Did you see it's so empty now? Oh, man. So we used... About 40 pillars. Oh my gosh, we used a lot, guys. We're down quite a bit again. So, yeah, that just means more metal gathering stuff and things going on. We still have a little bit. We still have some that we can get done. We still have some metal that we can use. But this is going to be really cool. Um, now, I guess the next portion of what we got to get done. First things first, we could turn this bad boy off. No, go down. Let me... Now, oh, can I please get let off? I can't get off. There's no possible way. Uh, turn the elevator off. And then what I'm going to do is go ahead and start getting all the stuff from these chests moved out of here um, and get moved over into the vaults. The vaults! And we're back in the wee hours of the morn, and I've done a bunch of stuff and things. I moved hardware and slow mobility over to the edges here, so they're not quite so far away from where the storage is. And I went ahead and built a couple other things. For now, I think we're going to keep this here, and it just will not do having it on the Statch Foundation. Nailed it, Ace! It can't be stopped. Now it looks like more... It's a part of the stuff and things here. So that looks cool, and I love the way these look. I love the way when they... I think they redid these. Well, they did redo these a few updates ago, and I love the way that those foundations look now. But um, in addition to that, we also must find a bird, uh, which we have right here. And then I think what we're going to do to give this a little bit more something-something is just come up here... And then grab one of these guys. And we're actually going to replace this right here. Nailed it! Replace this right here. Aced it! And then we're going to add some ladder. Some hot ladder action. No. No. Oh my gosh. Get in there. Do what I want, stupid ladder! Why? Why do you hate me, ladder? It won't place... There it was. There it was. Oh, we had it for a second. Why won't you go where I want? That's really hard. All right, let's try the other side. Shall we? Psst, perfect. So we should be able to get down in here. Uh, let's try this. Like so. There we go. Like so. One of these. One of them. All right, that looks good. Uh, let's get out of there. Nailed it, Ace. It can't be stopped. We got to get the other one on the other side, though. So now we got these metal ladders. And I've never built with these. I've never done anything with metal ladders before. You just got to be really careful when you come up not to fall off the edge. Let's see if we can get this guy real quick. There's got to be a way to get this. Why won't you not place there? Uh, What if we... Oh, almost. Oh, I got an idea. Let's go like this. Let's go like this. Let's go like this. Why will you not place on that side? So are they... I thought you could place them on all four sides, but it looks like you can't. So we've got to figure out a way. This is awesome, too, by the way. I can climb around. We've got to figure out a way. It looks like that there is a like a, a long pole there on the one side. And we've got to figure out a way to get that to happen ah! on this side. So we gotta, we've got to rotate this somehow. Um, all right, let's build another one. And I'll try to get it rotated so we can get it placed the correct way. And we're back, and it looks like that's just not going to happen. Um, we ran to another arc building snafu, 
And uh, there's just not a way to place a ladder on the other side of that hatch. I wanted one on each side for symmetry to make it kind of look cool like a like a thing. But it'll just be a functional thing that we have only on this side, I guess. And um, these... It also is strange to me that the ladders make a wooden ladder noise. Um, but yeah. <laughs> but it came out great. I think it's really cool. And it's been a lot of metal building. This is not going to work. Let's go over by the hind end of William Shatner. There we go. Perfect screenshot.